Hey everyone, this is Grandma Scratcher here in Florida and it is January 1st. And so I just thought I'd make a really short video with just a recap for everyone who watches and has want questions and wonders what happens kind of behind the scenes financially with the wins and the spins on the channel. So the channel was started in October of this year. So October of 2022. So two, three months, right? Give or take. And so for the period of time of October of 2022, through December 31st of 2022, the total spends, sorry, the total spends on the channel was $2,017. So meaning overall $2,017 spent on tickets to scratch on the channel. I don't scratch off channel, people ask all the time. I don't, I don't, I don't have, there's not enough money for that yet. <laughs> Yeah, that would be fun. But as you guys also know, I always post my like loss porn. There's always losses posted. I don't hold anything back from you guys. I don't try to make myself look better than I am. I post everything, all the wins, all the losses. You guys are right there with me. So $2,017 spent. Um, the wins on the channel from all of those tickets that were purchased were $1,576, right? So it was a loss of $441, but it was definitely more than a 50% return, right? The return was more like three quarters, 75% return. I sadly didn't do that math before I started the video, but I'm sure somebody out there can work it out for me, Alvaro. Um, but the percentage is, is probably really close to 75%, a 75% return on my money, give or take, right? So better than expected, um, there was that one pink ticket that was a $500 win that definitely helped. I don't know if my returns will continue to be like that throughout 2023. I mean, nobody really knows. I know that that was a really good return on my money. Um, a lot of people don't average that, um, but that's okay. Everybody's different. Everybody's got their own thing going on, you know? Nobody's the same. So it's all okay. But I did want to just give you guys like a realistic recap of what happens financially, um, you know, on a channel like like this, on a channel like mine, and what, what I spend and what I win. And because um, clearly everyone's looking for the big claimer, right? I mean, you don't scratch tickets unless you're looking for something, something big. You want a big win. But the reality is those wins, you know, are not that common. We hear about them a lot on uh, the news lately. God, I've heard about so many Palm Bay woman claims million dollar ticket, million dollar here, million dollar there. I haven't gotten my million dollar ticket yet, but I'm hoping, and you all know, I'm hoping for the $50,000 <laughs> on the cash blast ticket. But you know, this is the reality. The reality is it is gambling. It's gambling. You can't deny that. You're not going to win all the time. You're not going to win all your money back, but I win a good percentage back. And then I roll all of that money back into fresh tickets for the channel. That's what I do. Every once in a while, I put in a few extra dollars to add to it. Apparently, I put in $441 to add to it this, this year from October to December to have tickets to scratch on camera for you all. You know, scratching tickets for me is a form of entertainment. I don't go out and, and go to bars. We don't go out to dinner a lot. You know, I'm, I'm pretty much a homebody. So is my husband. Um, he finds it entertaining too. He likes to watch the videos and laugh. He can't believe some of the stuff I say, but uh, y you know, here, here I am. I'm me. I'm raw and unfiltered. The videos aren't edited. You guys know this because there's so many mistakes in the videos, but I don't, I don't edit. I just film what happens and put it up for you guys. You know, I mean, let's, let's be real. Let's just do the real life thing. Right. So anyways, just wanted to cover that for you all because uh, people ask, people ask, and I'm upfront. And by the way, I update these numbers on my, um, if you go to the YouTube channel and you go to, I think it's on the about page, um, it explains all of my stuff. And then at the very bottom, you'll see that I have on there typically updated once a month, sometimes more, depending on how I'm feeling. Um, it'll say year to date what's happened so far. So if you ever question, if you ever want to know, if you're just nosy and you want to know, and that's okay, because I am nosy too, uh, just click through and ask. Or if you don't see it there, uh, hit me up. I've got an email. You guys know this. It's grandmascratcher at gmail.com. You, um, you can leave a comment on any one of the videos 
and 90% of the time I respond that I feel so bad because sometimes I don't see comments until like weeks later. Sometimes they don't come through. There's like glitches in the system. They'll show up in one place, but not another. I try really hard to respond to all of you because you took the time to message me and I want to message you back. <clears throat> so any questions, anytime, just leave me a comment or send me an email. Yeah. Yeah. I'm approachable. I'm friendly. I'm Grandma Scratcher. That's how I roll. So let's have a great new year. Just wanted to let you know what happened this past year. I will see you all later.